Hello, here is High Tech. Today, I will introduce SCC Milksomatic Cell Counter. Preparation for operation. First, we need a SCC somatic cell counter, a mixer, puppet tips, centrifuge tube and holder, test chip, puppet. First, prepare four milk samples. Restore room temperature to 50 to 25 degrees. Now mix the milk sample. Mix evenly for 3 times, 1 to 2 seconds each time. Mix all 4 milk samples. Take out the 20 to 200 ul puppet. Adjust the range of the puppet 20 to 30 ul. Insert a tips into the puppet. Suck milk sample 1. Injection into centrifuge tube. Remove the packed tips. Then take milk samples from samples 2, 3, and 4. Cover the centrifuge tube. Put sample 1 on the vortex mixer for mixing. It is also mixed for 3 times, 1 to 2 seconds each time. Mix the other 3 samples in turn. Now take out the test chip. Take out the chip carefully. We can see the A, B, C, D on the chip. Then take out the puppet. Insert the puppet tips. Suck 20 to 30 ul of upper liquid of sample 1. Inject sample 1 into the microwell of chip. Until the enter cell is filled. Inject samples 2, 3, and 4 into B, C, and D, respectively. Equipment operation. Open the power. Perheating. Click the continue button. Click the start button. Set the detect milk sample type here. Set the sample name here. Click the continue detection button. Insert the detection chip as prompted. Click Continue Detection button. Chip detection and analysis in development. First test milk sample 1. Test the four samples in sequence. Click the Print button after the test is completed. Click the Save and the Exit button. Remove the chip as prompted. Click the continue button again. The detect somatic fluorescence diagram can be seen from the interface. Here shows number of somatic cells detected per cubic meter. 
we can see the graph clearly. Here we can set dairy product type, somatic cell size, etc. Click on the type of milk to say that in addition to milk, goat milk and high-fat milk can also be detected. 